working on a 5SFE 2.2 Toyota, it's on a 95 Camry. And uh, there's a, there a nice little drip of oil coming out of this motor. Uh, what I noticed is the oil would drip at a higher rate when the engine was cold and then when it would cease to drip or almost no drip when the engine warmed up and uh, to me that sounded like uh, oil pressure related when it's cold the oil pressure is higher and uh, I think that oil pressure would have been the issue and it was if it was a cam or crank seal this is a crank seal cam seal it would have dripped all the time or even more when it's hot because there's no pressure uh, this is a video just to show you what it looks like with all the components taken off timing components this is a cam seal water pump uh, and down here is the crank seal and this is the oil pump Oil pump housing. When it's installed, push it on here. There's a little kit that you can buy that has the seal and the O-ring. In this case, the O-ring failed. So you can see right over here. It's rock hard from age. Not from those pills you use. You get into your midlife crisis. Anyways, O ring failure and uh, the seal failure caused this to drip, and it was dripping right over here and leaking out. So it kind of looked like it could have been the oil pan, might have been the cam or the crank seal, but it was actually the oil pump seal. And pretty simple to get to just do a timing belt job and uh, pull the 10 millimeter bolts and get and replace the seal it's the kit that I'm installing it's the part number brand new seal and the o-ring We'll put that on and we'll be good to go. This is just a video to show you what can typically leak on these 2.2 uh, liter engines with a timing belt in the Toyota. Hope that helps somebody.